case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1952, the United States District Court for the District of Columbia heard the case of Heller v. District of Columbia. The case centered around the question of whether certain property transfers made by Miss Pauline Baum before her death would be subject to tax. Under the estate tax law, taxes can be imposed on estates, beneficiaries' shares, and gifts if made in contemplation of death. Miss Baum intentionally did not include three properties in her inheritance tax return, which were later discovered and taxed by the district tax authorities. These properties had been given to her nephew and his family before her death. The Board of Tax Appeals upheld the additional taxes, but the decision was appealed for possible reversal. The court reviewed the case and assessed whether the transfers were made in contemplation of death and if Miss Baum retained any interest in the property for life. It was found that Miss Baum had given up her rights to the trust property's income before her death. However, this did not exempt the transfers from tax because they were still considered made in anticipation of her passing. Ultimately, the court upheld the Board of Tax Appeals' decision to impose additional taxes on the omitted properties and transfers for inheritance tax purposes. This ruling served as a reminder that property, gifts, and shares given away before one's death may still be subject to tax under certain circumstances. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.